Hi, my name is Bob and I'm in Silicon Valley. I work full time, but I've been attending Ibanon Tech's Academy for about two years part time now. And I think one of the problems that Ivan has is communicating the scale of exactly how much is in the academy. So I thought I would share with you some of my notes that I've taken along the way, just without giving too much away, just for scale. So the first course you're going to encounter is the fundamentals of, of the blockchain. And it starts off by talking about the benefits of uh, blockchain provenance, high availability, that sort of thing, uh, censorship resistance, goes into the difference between cryptocurrencies and blockchains, uh, blockchains being the underlying technology, cryptocurrencies being an application. Uh, it talks about hashing functions and demonstrates how those are used to create uh, blockchains and secure the network. It goes into the basics of the first cryptocurrency, Bitcoin, and how its internals work, uh, what, how wallets interact with transactions, mempool, um, and chain length, and all that sort of thing. Um, talks about how we're going to overcome problems in scaling. If everybody were trying to use it, what would happen? And the technologies that are being developed for that talks about the vulnerabilities of the blockchain and how to, it could be attacked. Uh, talks about various different mining algorithms besides proof of work, um, proof of stake, delegated proof of stake, and other esoteric things. Uh, then it introduces blockchain 2.0, which is more programmable in Ethereum. Uh, then you start talking about smart contracts. Talks about how you might want to think about investing in blockchains as utilities and other businesses are built upon. Talks about the global importance of blockchain, how it's going to solve some of the uh, major stumbling stones of civilization today. Talks about the token economy and how uh, the new value is going to be uh, collected and distributed through tokens on blockchains. It talks about industrial blockchains. Um, and these are chains for consortiums to use amongst themselves and internally to companies and uh, in industries. Uh, talks about the customer facing implications of adding blockchains into various industries. If you are going to invest in a new project or a project that you, that's new to you, here's the checklist of the research you should be doing and ends on a discussion of the national um, digital currency initiatives that are coming up and the differences between those and a real blockchain and it gets into decentralized finance um, this is of course is really exciting talking about replacing the current banking system with financial lego and what that means and how that works and what you can do with it it's very uh, encouraging. Now, this is the developer track that I've started down. I started talking about smart contract programming, uh, how to be a programmer. The first thing they're going to teach you is JavaScript, which is highly useful. In fact, just with JavaScript, you can go in and take the course on how to build a trading bot. Or if you're so inclined to take the Unity and Engine token uh, game development course before they start talking about solidity and how to con how to write smart contracts. Um, then it gets into C++, starts talking about the EOS blockchain, and that's about as far as I've gotten. So that's about halfway through the courses that are there. There's more coming out every day. Um, it, the academy is immense. I just hope I was able to convey a bit of the size of it to you. So I'll see you in the forums. Have fun.